Because I'm with Joseph and, uh, Frederick, and he has done We're Sinking, and we are really excited because we're going to get to cover it. And we're at Gen Con at his booth right now, and he's going to tell us about the game. Joseph, what do you got? Ah, all right. So this is We're Sinking. It's a three to six player uh, game, plays in about 45 to 90 minutes. And you all are pirates on a ship. You just got back uh, on board with a bunch of uh, treasure that you, you just uh, happened to come across. The deck here is full of a bunch of treasure and items. And uh, suddenly, you are under attack by the Kraken. Man. So Kraken is attacking each round, dealing damage in various ways. Uh, they're going to be doing things like adding water to your ship punching holes into your ship, uh, knocking your cannons offline. Yeah. And you all, as a crew, you get to choose to be one of these colorful characters. You are going to be discussing what you're going to be doing about this. So, yeah, so I may tell the crew, uh, hey y'all, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to bucket water. So I'm going to go down this column here. Don't worry about the water. I got it taken care of. Somebody else may go over here and uh, decide to patch some of these breaches, but they may be like, you know, I could really use a hand. There's a lot going on over here. So, so somebody else may help. Maybe somebody goes over here and fires the cannons at the Kraken, because that's really important. After that happens, everyone's placed their dials down. We're going to reveal the dials and see if we had any liars. Uh-oh. And... Indeed, um, I'm sorry, I did lie. I'm actually going to be going over here and taking some of this treasure for myself. I just couldn't help myself. I'm a greedy, greedy pirate. Jack, well, But that's uh, very, um, not very uh, long-term thinking of myself because nobody was bucking the water this round. Right. Which means uh, each at the beginning of each round, we're gonna be checking the threshold. And if we're ever over that threshold, the ship is going to be sinking. And there's only four layers of the ship, so if you fully sink, the game is over. And whoever has the fewest cards in their hand, if that happens, uh, will be the winner. They're the lightest. They're lightest. They're lightest. They, they want to be the lightest ones to get on the light boat and get away. That's perfect. That is perfect. Alternatively, if you can manage to defeat the Kraken before the uh, ship sinks, you want to be the pirate with the most treasure in your hand so that you can be the wealthiest pirate at the end of the day. Super fun push and pull there, right? Like, yeah. And it's not you are assigned a role. You can just choose to play how you want to play. Yeah. Uh, which is really cool because then it's not like, oh, well, Tim's the traitor. We can't trust him. You know, the rest of the game, like blah, blah, blah. Like, no, I just had a moment of weakness. <laughs> There's plenty of sabotage, uh, plenty of backstabbing to go along the way for everyone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but I've also seen people play this completely straight. Sure. Until they realize and remember that there is only one winner. Right, because you um, either have the most treasure or the least treasure, but the right. ship's on. So, yeah. Yeah. So there's two ways to win the game, only one winner, and plenty of opportunities to work together and backstab along the way. Man. And it's been very popular here at the show. He's been selling out. Uh, it's pretty exciting and very cool. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we're excited. The production quality is crazy. It's super good. You can see that here. I mean, he's got a big freaking pirate ship with multiple layers. What more do you want? Um, there's hidden treasures on each layer, right? Oh yeah, I forgot to mention that, that uh, each time you lose a layer of the ship, uh, some treasure chests will float to the surface for more things for you all to go after. Uh, they're gonna be things like cannon upgrades or they're gonna give you gold, things for you to go after, your, uh, you know, to be selfish about. But yeah, you can upgrade your cannons. You can, uh, you know, you can get rid of the the breaches. Some of the breaches can be really nasty, uh, depending on how many players you're going oh, with. Oh wow! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Awesome. And uh, there's four enemies in the base game. You got, you can choose basically your scenario. You can go up against the Kraken, uh, the Skeleton Crew, the Sirens, or the Megalodon Shark. And then we have an expansion uh, as well adds two additional enemies, the ghosts or the navy. Sweet, sweet, lots of choices. Uh, yeah. Really fun, really cool. Uh, looking forward to getting to play it. So, yeah, hopefully soon. Well, yeah. thank you, Joseph. Really appreciate it. Glad you've had a successful Gen Con and uh, look forward to seeing you again. Awesome, thanks for coming by. Yeah, thanks, man. <laughs> Every
you can say the title's only three words. <laughs>